I was uh, standing out in front of the 7-Eleven. I guess uh, somebody had called the police, maybe somebody prior to that, uh, you know, before I got there, had maybe tried to shoplift or something. I don't know exactly why they were called. But uh, I was standing out there, probably looking scrubby. I was homeless at the time. And, and uh, John was a lot younger. He might have been a sergeant at the time. Um, was with this rookie officer. And they're maybe about 20 steps away from me, walking up from uh, Guadalupe. And, and the, uh, I think they pulled their car up right by that uh, bus stop there. And um, the rookie officer started to, to come up on me quicker. So John's just a little bit behind him. And he's going to just grab me. Like, he's coming up to grab me, like, by the shoulders, you know. And I, just out of instinct, I'm thinking, defend myself. I'm not being arrested. I'm, I, you know, I've done nothing wrong. I've got no warrants. I know this, you know. So I drop back, like, you know, you can't grab me like that, you know. And I had my fist up like I was ready to defend myself. And, and John catches up to him, puts his hand on his shoulder. He said, you can't do that, you know. This man's a citizen. He has every right to defend himself. Then... He went into the uh, the gas station, asked me just to wait there, went in the gas station, I guess, to talk to the attendant at, at the cash register, and came out and said, yeah, you know, you're free to go, you know, it, it, whoever was being called on, you're not the suspect. So, you know, at that point, I, I really felt like John restored my faith with the police at that point.